Dictionaries are unordered. Of course they have an order. This isn't a predictable order. So what happens if you sort a dictionary? Can you sort a dictionary in Swift? Does it even make sense? Let's look at some code and find out. Dictionaries are fantastic and we use them to perform operations such as counting the frequency of elements. So here we've got an array of animals and I want to count how many dogs, cats and other animals there are. So I can traverse through the array and put those animals into the dictionary. So for each animal I want to go to my dictionary and I want to use subscripting to add my animal in. And it's going to have a default value because when we first run it we won't have any of that particular animal. The default is zero and we add one to each. Now there's a problem here, sometimes dog has an uppercase letter, sometimes a lowercase letter, so I'll just put all of them as lowercase in. So this is going to create my, going to add elements to my dictionary. Now one issue with dictionaries is they're naturally unordered, so we're not going to get a nice ordered dictionary. 5, 6, 1, 1. What if I wanted them in descending order? So you want dogs, then cats, then cows and rabbits. So then we can use swift sorting. So often you'd just say sorted by and we can print out the result. Okay, that looks roughly correct, but the issue is this is no longer a dictionary. And we do need to be careful here, so I can use Swift to tell me what that type is. I'm pressing Option there. So it's an array of dictionary element types, and that means we can no longer use subscripting on elements, because dictionaries naturally don't have an order. Actually, that's not correct. Of course they have an order, they don't have a predictable order. So I don't know ahead of time this dictionary, the order that the elements will be in. And when I originally printed them out, I didn't know for certain which order they would be in because they don't have a predictable order. However, this array of dictionary elements has a predictable order. Obviously, I've lost lots of the advantages of using a dictionary. However, it is the elements that were in the dictionary and they are now sorted. So it seems we can sort a dictionary, but you're not returned a dictionary because it makes sense that you can't sort something that doesn't have a predictable order. When you sort a dictionary, you're returned an array which does have an ordering. So then you can't use the special properties like subscripting of a dictionary you might expect. So it's something to be careful with, particularly if you're solving leak code style challenges. In any case, hope you enjoy coding.